Well, you know, when those temperatures drop, it can be tough to keep warm, but now there's a new space he heater that's hitting the market. Yeah, Dyson is promoting a cool looking space heater that Consumer Reports just tested. And consumer advocate Jen Strathman shows us how it stacks up. Dyson Hot heats the whole room faster than any other. This video spot for the Dyson Hot space heater sounds good, and the Dyson Hot sure looks good. What's not so hot about the Dyson is its price. At $400, it's one of the most expensive space heaters we've ever tested. So how did the Dyson Hot do in Consumer Reports labs? It passed this important safety test. A terry cloth is placed on the heater to see if it scorches or catches fire. The surface of the Dyson doesn't get so hot that you can't touch it, so that's not a safety risk. And it has another important safety feature. It shuts off if it's tipped over, but the remote presents a safety risk to young children. It has a small button cell battery that's easily accessible and hazardous if swallowed. If you have young children, you should make sure that the remote is kept out of their reach. You can operate the space heater without the remote. This test assesses how evenly space heaters distribute heat. Sensors measure the temperature in different parts of the room. The Dyson Hot did an excellent job, but it didn't score well for noise. At its highest fan setting, the Dyson is one of the loudest space heaters we've ever tested. Instead, Consumer Reports says a better choice is this Vornado space heater. It's the Touchstone 500 Vortex Heat for $120. Even on high, it's not very noisy. On your side, Jen Strathman, News Channel 5.